Hello, this is Neil Griffiths and you might know that I've got back to storytelling because I've missed it so much during our lockdown. And here is Itchy Bear's best friend, Sneezy. He's lovely, isn't he? And I thought you might like another bear story. So here we go with Sneezy Bear. Bear was enjoying a nice, cool soap. In fact, he would have soaked all day long if he hadn't begun to feel hungry. He spotted some plump silver salmon. Mmm, -hmm, he mumbled as his tummy rumbled. Achoo! Oh, my goodness. Oh, dear, sighed Bear. But then he saw a tree full of juicy red cherries. Ooh, yummy, he mumbled as his tummy rumbled. Achoo! Oh, Oh dear, dear, sighed Bear. But then Bear found a bush full of ripe blueberries. Scrummy, he mumbled as his tummy rumbled. Oh, oh, oh. What oh, oh. oh dear, 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 sighed Bear. Next, Bear saw an anthill full of his favourite tiny ants. Ooh, he mumbled as his tummy... Oh, oh dear, 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 sighed Bear. Bear lay down in the cool shade of a tree. He just had to stop sneezing or he'd never get any food in his tummy. Oh dear, 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 thought Bear. This just isn't my day. Oh, yummy honey for my grumbly tummy. He slurped. Stickily delicious, he sighed happily. But not everyone was quite so happy. <laughs> <laughs> 